Do you hate ads? I hate ads. You know what I love? Patreon.com slash Inkdependence, where patrons get access to a patron-only Discord, ad-free videos, and the joy of knowing they help support this channel. Hello folks, welcome to Independence. I'm Mike, and today I have uh I got this big old I got this big old box here. This is from Endless Pens, and it is some stuff that um that I ordered a long time ago. I I mean it's been it's been a long time. I'm actually not sure when it was. Uh I think it was within their like 99 day pre-order window thing. Uh, but honestly, I'm not 100% sure. There was a hurricane, so I'm not going to like check it. I think it was pretty close. But um, this should be a pair of pens or a pair of pen sets. Uh, when I order stuff from Endless as a pre-order, I just kind of know it's going to take a while. Let's see if it has a... Um, so it has a date. Uh, it does not. No, no, no date on the invoice. All right, so... Uh, we have here is from the Sailor Manio fountain pen set number three, their third set. There we go. Let's throw that on the floor. Yeah, get these out of here. So the thing about pre-orders is they might take a very long time, but um, they were uh, a really, really solid deal. So um, I ended up getting two sets. I got the Gourd and the Persimmon. Uh, I went fine because that's what they had on this one. And I went with Medium Fine because I actually like the Medium Fines quite a lot on the Gourd. So that's what I went with on this one. But um, these, uh, these take a long time to get in sometimes. And I'm not sure exactly why, but... Uh, the price differential is pretty powerful, and so I went for that because uh, these were, I forget what I ended up paying for each set. I want to say it was like, uh, it was like a hundred and change. Like it was not, it was not that bad for each set. And these are Sailor Pro Gear Slims with an ink, uh, and I think retail or, um, you know, street price now is something like 230 or something like that for these sets. So um, while it did take forever... Um, it is still kind of an amazing deal. And since Sailor has been jacking up their prices, really? That's not even, that is, that side doesn't even open. They got me, y'all. They, that's, they got me. All right. Can I get in this side? Wow. All right. All right. There we go. Oh, this is just a little Kershaw something i don't know what this one's called but it's like a little teeny little teeny tiny knife i don't think it has a name on it it doesn't uh it's just a little kershaw with a bottle opener so i carry this around every once in a while let's go for opening mail all right so let's take a look at the persimmon first persimmon sometimes when i'm looking at these sets i honestly look at the ink a lot too because all the pens look cool there are several in this set and they all look neat but um, they each come with a monyo ink and sometimes those inks are just gonna be too light to use in the pen and i don't love that so i tend to pick ones that i also like uh where i also like the ink all right so this one comes with a budo which we will take a look at here in a minute we've got our uh, sailor uh, informations we have our converter and then the pen so this here is our fine. Um, let me get a scissors right quick. There we go. Snip. All right. So, there we go. There's our persimmon, which I think is a really handsome color combo. I think this is the one that I was like, Audrey, I got to get this one because I really like this one. Uh, I really like this navy barrel. I like the translucent orange cap and finial. I think that's awesome. You have your little persimmon up here. On another translucent uh, orange bit there and then the nib is your typical sailor 14k uh pro gear slim nib so pretty pretty nice it's a gold colored furniture i do uh i do like the gold on here i'm generally a, a silver furniture kind of dude but i think the gold looks really nice on this one so uh yeah not unhappy about that at all do they give me a cartridge for this i actually don't see one in the box no, nope, I guess not. They're like, I'm giving you a bottle of ink and a converter. What are you going to do a cartridge for? You're not going to use a cartridge. Fair. Fair enough. All right, let me just uh, put this back together. Grab those. There. Good. All right, let's look at the gourd, which is a fun name. Gourd is just a fun word to say. All right, here is the gourd. Oops, forgot to put the phone back in the other one. Whoopsies. All right, this one comes with Sumomo. Looks like fun. I guess that might be a peach. Kind of hard to say. What is this? Like grapes, maybe? I guess it's got to be grapes. All right. Here is our MF nib on this one. 
as I remember when we were looking at these, I was like, which one do you want, Audrey? And she's like, I don't know. They're pretty, all, they're all pretty awesome. So just get whatever. And I said, what if I get two? Because the price is bonkers. So on this one, we have this kind of, uh, I don't know, tomato-y sort of barrel. And then the cap, what color is that even? I think it's a like a dark green grayish kind of color for the cap and the section of the finial. That's really nice. Uh, again, gold hardware on here and a little gourd for, can we, can we focus? Cause some influencer hands up here. There you go. A little, well, I don't know. It says gourd, but it doesn't look like a gourd. That looks like a peach. Okay. Is this gourd? I got the right. Is that? Oh, this is the persimmon. Was it gourd the other one? <laughs> this is the persimmon. I am so dumb. Uh, I was like, this isn't, it looks like a fruit. I actually don't really know what a persimmon looks like. I'm not sure I've ever seen one growing on it. In fact, I'm sure I've never seen one growing on a tree. Uh, but all right, persimmon. Cool. I'll take that. That's fine. All right. Yeah, it looks really nice. I'm going to grab this and this. Let's see what this ink looks like real quick. All right, this is the last page of my oversized original coloring. Uh, the very last page. I've got inks on so many other pages. This is the last one. I actually just had to look this up on the Endless Pen site where they are listed still as a pre-order. And it looks like you can still order these. I don't know how long it's going to take to get them. Um, but I had to look up which ones were which um, just because I, I took off the plastic sleeve and then... I didn't have anything on the, the thing which told me what they were. So uh, be careful with the plastic sleeve. You'll forget which ones you have. So this one, uh, this one right here is the gourd. And it comes with this one with this ink, which is Sumomo. Uh, and this like the finial there doesn't have a gourd on it. It has whatever that critter is, whatever that kind of fruit thing is. Um, let me let me Google this and see what see what the deal is with that Sumomo. Oh, it's a plum. OK. So this is a plum, but it looks like, hmm, I, this is, so, so the pen is called the gourd. It has a picture of a plum on the finial right there. And then this is Sumomo, which is a type of plum. Um, and then this one has got to be persimmon and persimmon comes with budo, which is a type of fruit that just looks like grapes. It's not actually grapes, but it does look like grapes. Interesting. Um, Huh, you'd think they put a picture of a gourd on there. I don't know. Okay, let's look at these inks real quick. Because, <laughs> man, they are really throwing me for a loop. All right. This is a very nice, very dark blue. This Budo, which is interesting. I'm not seeing, I guess there are some, I'm, so, I'm looking at pictures over here of these fruits and it looks like they are sometimes like a dark blue. So that's pretty cool. Kind of like a, like if a blueberry grew like grapes, that's kind of what they look like. So that's neat. I really like that color. That's a good one. I think it matches this pen very nicely. All right, let's look at this one. Ooh, ooh, look at that color. Okay, I like it already. Yeah, all so gorgeous and a nice match for this pen. OK, so I was a little salty about the ways that the uh, that the pens don't match their names, but they match the inks. But wow, those are uh, very good. I think that's a good match for both of those. We're matching the barrel colors there. And uh, yeah, I really like it. I think that's great. So um, there you have it. That's uh, that's part of the Sailor Manio 3 set. Uh, I've got a couple from the other ones. Like it came with one called Nuts. And uh, I feel like there are some others as well. But um, these are really pretty. I'm glad I finally have them in my hands. So thanks, Endlesser, um, for getting these out to me. Even following a hurricane, uh, I bought these on their site. And um, you can too. So um, go find these from your sa favorite Sailor retailer and uh, tell them I said hi. I have a discount code or rather an affiliate code down there in the uh, in the description for Endless in case you'd like to uh, let them know where you found this stuff and several other stores. So, hey, thanks very much for watching. Uh, and until the next video, peace out.